Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Selenix Crypto and welcome to a, a bullish update on Solana, or at least that's what I thought this morning when I woke up and I saw Solana on top of 150, uh, the main resistance level, as you all know, which we have talked about for, for a week now, we had to break. Um, so it started off very bullish, but what we saw over the course of, uh, of, of this morning is that we did get a breakout on the four hour time frame. Um, but it's a it's it's a very minor one, all right. And I'm I'm not completely sure yet whether we can whether we can trust that. So we'll talk about that. But in general, uh, what we saw apart from that is that uh, Bitcoin is showing some strength in the Bitcoin dominance, while Bitcoin itself is falling down a bit. So that's um, that's not good for altcoins, all right. And Solana, whether well, it's a very big altcoin, of course. Uh, but it's still an altcoin, and it's still correlated for about eighty percent to Bitcoin. So that does matter. Now, ultimately, many of you already know my uh, know my thoughts on, on Solana, right? I think Solana, uh, and we already saw some some early indications of that, that the whole Solafax uh, narrative, so that Solana, Afax, uh, and Luna, or uh, Solufax, I think, I, I don't know. Um, but we already saw some bullish momentum from that, and we know that, um, so something like that is coming. Uh, Solana is very popular under under retail, so uh, retail. Even though the Coinbase rankings I saw were were dropping a bit, but I do I do assume that retail at some point of time will will come back, and slowly get into the markets. And then uh, Solana fundamentally is still doing great, and it's almost at that uh, ten billion dollars in total value locked, which at this moment places it in the top four, and it's about to enter the top three in terms of uh, chains, which is obvious, which is amazing. All right. So something like this I do expect, but right now, like I said, I mean, it's it's very well possible. And I talked about that in a Bitcoin video as well. I'm still bullish on Bitcoin, all right? I think the market circumstances will remain bullish. And that in combination with with uh, what Solana is doing right now um, can only lead, in my eyes, to a bullish breakout. And then apart from that, I mean, if you, if, if you look at this structure... Um, Sure, we had a flush, but this is definitely not bearish, all right? We're making higher highs and higher lows. Um, so technically, fundamentally, and if you take into account the market, I'm bullish on Solana. And I think we'll, we'll get a solid breakout above 150 pretty soon. Right now, though, like I said, we, we have to wait for it a bit. If we can get another candle close above like 152, which is also a level we wicked up to quite often, if we can get a breakout like that, I would say that's enough confirmation to actually assume that that right now we're breaking out and we can get up to 165 or 175, 180. Uh, those are my price targets, all right? So first 165 and then that level at 175, technically all the way up to 185, but I'll, I'll refer to it as 180 from now on. So that's also possible today, but we just need a, a decent bounce from Bitcoin. If Bitcoin bounces and if Bitcoin breaks above 72,500, I would assume that uh, AFAX and Solana will rally as well so that we break above 152 uh, and start rallying from there. But if we're not able to do that, then I assume that Bitcoin uh, got some sort of a bigger pullback. And for Solana, Solana is still very strong. I don't expect it to, to have major crashes down, but I do think a drop into, into, into 144 and potentially even 140 is a possibility then, after which we will just consolidate and eventually break out. All right, so that's um, what I think you need to know. I mean, obviously, or obviously, I mean, if if Bitcoin really gets a big pullback and it loses a lot of momentum, uh, then it's possible that, that 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 the situation for Solana changes as well. But I would be um, I would be very surprised if that happens. Let's let's keep it at that. But those are my thoughts. That's what I think you need to know for now. If you do have any questions, then let me know down in the comments. But for now, thank you for watching. Take care, and bye.